Jeremy, because you are the newbie here today, we are starting with you. And we're gonna start off with how HBO Max is celebrating comedian Bob Saget. That's right. We've obviously been uh, all talking a lot about Bob Saget, about his life, about his career, uh, and really just dealing with what was shocking news to hear of his passing. It is so beloved by so many people. But um, HBO Max, I was flipping through the other day and saw that they had prompted um, his stand-up special. It's called That Ain't Right. It's from 2007. So it, it really showcases the other side of Bob Saget that so many of the, you know, the Full House fans were either through, through the years completely shocked by or loved discovering about Bob Saget that, that maybe people didn't know about, uh, you know, his anti-wholesome image. He, he was, obviously most people knew him as the wholesome all-American dad, but Bob's comedy and, and his stand-up was always very raunchy, very vulgar, uh, stream of consciousness said whatever dark, wild, dirty thing came to his mind. And, and that became a real branding thing for him when it came to, uh, you know, going to comedy clubs around the country. So That Ain't Right is a really good example of it. It was, again, from 2007. So kind of as he was um, branching out, doing more and more of that publicly in the wake of Full House and, and kind of having that place in pop culture, but, but, but building on it and turning it. Here was the description on, on HBO Max. It says one, a, a one hour torrent of adults only material, which is kind of the perfect description uh, when you think about that. And look, if you're into that, that's great. And if you want to look at his other work, it's also streaming. Here's the quick list. Full House is on HBO Max, Fuller House, obviously Netflix. America's Funniest Home Videos is on Amazon. Welcome to America's Funniest Home Videos. I'm Bob Saget, but hey, enough about me. He was my America's Funniest Home Videos host growing up. And he had that unique, very dry and sort of weird sense of humor in that show, in that setting. So. Uh, he hosted that for eight seasons, and you can check that out. How I Met Your Mother, he was a narrator. That's on Hulu. Entourage, he had a famous role on that. It's on HBO Max as well. So look, Bob, so beloved, so kind, embraced so many different people, and you've seen that outpouring of love for him um, since his passing. So check out That Ain't Right or any of those other things to pay your own personal tribute to Bob. Jeremy, I got to tell you, I checked out That Ain't Right, and <laughs> it, holy cow. It's Was it dirty? Is filthy. it raunchy? It's filthy in the best way possible. It's literally laugh out loud funny. It's not like, you know how sometimes at comedy shows, everyone's laughing a little bit and clapping. It's spit take funny. He And he goes in on some of his uh, Full House stars. He roasts them and it's it was genius. It was really well done. I'm happy HBO Max put this out. Yeah. When Bob Saget, one of the last times he was in here at People and I interviewed him, it was with his other castmates. And he kind of roasted John Stamos right there during the interview. He kind of went in on him like how at the very beginning, they, he wasn't so sure about him. And he had women coming in and out. Like he he sort of embellished and made some funny jokes about Stamos being such a playboy and a heart. Yeah, because they were that. best friends in real life. They were actually best friends. Right. And they they yeah. come they all came to be such close friends and, and such a tight knit family behind the scenes that he definitely had the leeway to roast them and everyone loved it. Everyone was sort of in on the joke. And, and once you know what to expect with Bob Saget and that kind of humor, you can settle into it after you get past how jarring it is. Yeah. And it is really funny. It really was, well done.